Wow, that's a really good view. Whoa, look at that mouse cam. Look, you guys can be watching the video, you know, watching my reaction, and then you can be like watching my mouse. That's that's really cool. Okay, you want to know how hot dogs are made? Or well, you came to the right place. Okay, so I've literally uh, spent so long trying to get my webcam to work. So if, if my webcam just freezes like halfway through the video, it, it's not my fault, okay? I've really tried to record this video well. But in today's video, we're going to be reacting to a video that I actually saw on my recommended list. Haha. <laughs> called How's It Made Hot Dogs. Now... I'm actually quite interested in this topic, believe it or not. I like a good hot dog. Who doesn't like a good hot dog? You know, just a little bit of a, a little bit of a lick of a hot dog. Who doesn't like to do that? Leave me a comment. Uh, I know some people are gonna be going, "Oh, but Cameron, I'm vegetarian." You, you still like the vegetarian hot dogs? I know you do. I was actually curious to see how they're made because if anyone's seen a hot dog before, uh, everyone literally, uh, <laughs> they don't look particularly, you know succulent. They, they, they look fake. I swear all hot dog sausages look fake. So it's gonna be quite interesting to see how they actually make hot dogs. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave me a like. If this video does well, I might react to another How's It Made video because these are actually really informative and quite interesting and I want to give you guys my two cents. Yeah. Don't eat during this video, please. Let's click ha <laughs> play. It's actually quite interesting seeing how industry utilizes the production of like hot dogs and crap. It's just interesting. Hot dogs are an all American fair, but most likely it was German sausage makers who first came up with the idea. Oh, I love the um, cinematics. I, I can't go over them. Like they've actually put like a color filter over the stock footage of hot dogs, which is pretty cool, I think. It really, you know, it really showcases the the quality of the hot dogs. <laughs> this video is so sad. <laughs> if you're a vegetarian slash vegan, don't watch this video. Un unless you want a reason to be vegetarian or vegan. <laughs> If you are new to the channel, also be sure to subscribe, help me out. We're trying to hit 6,000 subs by the end of the year. Can we do it? Probably not. It don't matter, okay. Traditional hot dogs are made from a mix of pork, beef, and chicken. <laughs> I love it how they have to be labeled chicken. Just, just chicken. We're not going to tell you what, what part the chicken is from. It's, it's from a chicken, okay? The cuts they start with are called trimmings. What the f Pieces of meat left over from cutting steaks or pork chops. Hey, see, this is the meat after the good part of it's been taken out. This looks just like John's stomach. Like, this is what happens in John's stomach while he's recording a video. He has a worker in his stomach who, like, forces the food down his intestines. Oh, God. I have no funny commentary for this. I I'm genuinely disgusted. <laughs> There's so much flipping meat there, like, I kind of want to jump into it. <laughs> Imagine what that would feel like. Process. See, I don't really like hot dogs, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> this is just reinforcing my opinion at this point. What is that? Processed chicken trimmings are added to the ground meat. Oh, can we just skip the chicken? Can we, no, can we just... No, nah, I don't want that. What part of the chicken is that even from? It's, it's from a chicken, okay? Followed by food starch, salt, and other flavorings. I'm sorry, but there's nothing appetizing about all-purpose salt. <laughs> like, they couldn't have named it anything else. They couldn't have named it, uh, I don't know utility salt or something a little bit appetizing no all-purpose salt you could just use it for everything okay food grade sodium chloride wow that's definitely true water is sprayed into the mix and everything is blended together in a big vat <laughs> they just blend it together <laughs> wow
corn syrup adds a dash of sweetness. Just a dash. <laughs> Just a dash. It looks like a beach. Like a really bad beach. What I mean by that is you, you'd see this beach and you'd be like, you know what? We're on holiday, but we're going back home. <laughs> the addition of even more water helps to disperse the ingredients and make the hot dogs juicier. No, it just makes the hot dogs cheaper to make. Do you think these workers eat hot dogs still? After working the production line, I imagine they would because they'd be so used to it. I mean, it, it looks disgusting, but it's not really that bad when you think about it. It's just grinded up meat. It's, it's indifferent to normal meat when you think about it, but it's still pretty disgusting. I mean, I don't know. Long rolls of cellulose tubing are loaded into the stuffing machine. <laughs> the stuffing machine? What do you mean, John? <laughs> It pumps the meat puree into these casings, twisting it every five and a quarter. She looks like she likes a good sausage, you know what I mean? <laughs> God, she just looks like she wants to die. Paula! It takes just 35. I would smash, not, not gonna lie. Five seconds to make a chain of hot dogs that would span a soccer field twice. Then. Three of those hot dog chains are linked together to make an even longer string, and they're loaded several at a time into another machine, which drapes the hot dogs onto moving racks. The process is carefully timed so that a twist always lands on the bar. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool how efficient they are at making them. Hot out of the oven, these franks are drenched in cold, salty water to chill them in preparation for packaging. Yeah, hot dogs are healthy, by the way. <laughs> they just chill them with salt water. <laughs> the hot dogs then file down. It's like a roller coaster. Just a roller coaster that I wouldn't want to go on. The hot dogs then file down to an unloading zone. Here, a machine pulls them off the bars onto a conveyor. Then, the hot dogs slide off the conveyor into metal containers. If you've been wondering about those black stripes on the casings, all is about to be revealed. This guy looks happy about his job. Uh, you keep putting them sausages in that hole, boy. Inside the peeler machine, a tiny knife slits each casing along the top. Then... I love this machine. Town Send 2000... And 600, I think this company, you know, they know their technology. I only have the Townsend 69, yeah. Steamy air blows the casings right off the dogs. Then it's into a device that looks like a plastic bicycle chain. The sprockets position the hot dogs for packaging. Well, how sophisticated the machinery is just for hot dogs. This factory manufactures an incredible 300,000 hot dogs an hour. What an hour! <laughs> I was expecting him to say a day. That's a lot. Jesus. And them out like sausages. Fire up the grill and a mouth-watering meal is just minutes away. I'm not even going to lie. I thought it was going to be more disgusting than that. Oh my god, never mind. They start off so badly. Jesus Christ, it's very surprising how they they look so good now. Haha, <laughs> why does it look so dark? Oh yeah, because I haven't got my light on. Sorry about that, I had to mention that in the video. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you fire up the grill. Uh, serve me a hot dog. I'll have two hot dogs with mustard on, please, thanks. I uh, hope you guys have a good day. I, I really don't like hot dogs. This has not helped at all. Uh... Thank you guys for watching this video though. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave me a like, leave me a comment, and also subscribe to the channel if you're new today. Get grilling. And I'll get killing. Going in.